In this problem, we're going to use Boyle's Law. We are told that a gas sample in a cylinder with a movable piston is set at a volume of 5.00 liters. The pressure of the gas inside the cylinder is 0 0.900 atmospheres. We want to calculate the pressure of the gas when the volume is decreased to 4.00 liters. Boyle's Law states that the volume of a gas is inversely proportional to its pressure. We can mathematically state Boyle's Law as the following. The pressure of a gas times the volume of that gas is a constant, or P1 times V1 is equal to P2 times V2. In this equation, P1 and V1 are the initial pressure and initial volume of the gas, and P2 and V2 are the final pressure and final volume of the gas. In this problem, we know three variables. We know the initial volume, the initial pressure, and the final volume. We need to rearrange our equation so that all of the known variables are on one side, so we can solve for our unknown variable, which is the final pressure. When we do this, we see that the final pressure, or P2, is equal to P1 times V1 all over V2. So our final pressure is equal to the initial pressure times the initial volume, all divided by the final volume. When we plug in our known values, our initial pressure was 0 0.900 atmosphere times our initial volume of 5.00 liters, all divided by our final volume of 4.0 liters, we find that we get a final pressure of 1.13 atmospheres.